Look, I'm not going to address again. Yeah. I got too near to a pond in the Seattle Arboretum that had one of these guys in it. Uh -huh. He chased me for like 10 feet. Holy cow. It came out of the water just hissing and snarling and making these awful screeching noises. And it chased me. And I am very certain that if I had stopped before it did, mm -hmm. I would it would have been up my leg. Wow. I mean, they're really aggressive. But for red wolves, these guys are candy. Oh, they love them. <laughs> <laughs> so now Alligator River has way fewer nutrients. Other places are starting to say, we'll take red wolves. It's that whole, again, apex predator thing. Mm -hmm. But there aren't enough red wolves and there's not enough land to... Wow, they took your green thing apart. <laughs> and you're actually standing. It must be close to dinner time. Um, so now more people are willing to take them, but they have to gather a group that's ready to go out and find somewhere that has everything they need, just like gray wolves, enough land with everything they need in it. So I guess this is lady hawk. Actually, this is Kytus. Oh, it is? Yes. Oh. This is Kytus. Go for two. Kytus I know, I suck at this game. Kytus. You like me, I know you like me. Because I was thinking that that one looked older. That's why, because I was looking at the dates there. Yeah. Yeah, well, Lady Hawk is older. Oh. She was born in 2000 and Kytus was born oh, in 2007. Oh, you're right. Oh, okay. I do that, too. I meant that the... Okay. <laughs> I reverse things all the time. <laughs> so, okay. we talk okay. about food here, mm -hmm. because if you look at Kytus' shape, and you look at any other wolf we go by, there's a difference with his shape. So it looks a little... You look like you've lost some weight, buddy. Heather or Wendy over there? Are the food ladies coming? Um, he's quite overweight. Okay. Um, he was raised by a young man in, in uh, up in Minnesota, and they got along great. The young man was military. He liked living out away from people. Mm -hmm. So they lived several miles from the nearest house. So Kytus had a lot of room to run around and do his own thing without scaring anyone half to death. Ah. And, uh... Yeah. Michael, you guys love But, uh... I'm slightly allergic to them, so. Oh, I understand. Um, I mean, I won't, like, die or anything, but I'll swell up, and I have to take a Benadryl and go to sleep. Yeah. So, Kytus got along great there. The young man was shipped overseas, um, and the only problem Kytus...